Hey, yo, I'm a gun club member. I'm gonna take these rookies downtown. Are you with me? Hey, what's your name, son? It's Luis, man. I don't think that's such a good idea. Yeah? They said catching that pass in my high school championship football game was a bad idea, because I broke my leg in 13 places, but I scored a touchdown and won the game. The world was built out of bad ideas, my friend. Come on. The PE-4 has been molded and is set to explode in 60 seconds. Now listen, people. We're your friends. Me and me brother here. Why are we... you telling them we're brothers, you idiot? That's gonna make it hard for them to find us, isn't it? I'm trying to be honest with these people. We put them through a lot today. Fuck these people. Fuck your cause. That shit's over. Ireland's not the only thing that's green. Dollars are too. Now you've said bloody Ireland. That's gonna narrow the search, ain't it? Fuck you! Take the needle out your arm, then tell me what to do! I'll let you tell me what to do when you stop shoving half of Bolivia up your nose every Saturday night! Motherfucker! <laughs> fuck! Oh. We told you about the fuck with us! <laughs> Shit! Michael! <laughs> Say fucking Michael! <laughs> fucking shit! Get the money! Me and my brother will watch the kids! Yeah, look at me in. Yeah, like I said, man, everything's a little fussy. Well, if you think of anything else, Mr. Lopez. Yeah, sure, sure, I'll give you a call. Thanks. Yo, what's up, Bobby? Hey, 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 hey. Hey, Tony, it's me. Yeah, there was a bomb at the bank. The place got robbed. Nothing to do with me, I, I swear. Um, some Irish guys. Anyway, um, listen, I'm coming over, okay? So wake up. You hear me? Wake up. Hey, my amigo, what's that? Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, no, I, I was working late at the club. Yeah, mommy, don't be like that, okay? I'll be home soon. Look, I, I gotta go. Okay. Who the fuck is it? It's me, though. No. Oh, whatever. Come up. Oh, how are you? I'm good, boss. How are you? Ooh, you look terrible. <laughs> That's good, because I am terrible. Fucking wretched. What's wrong? Oh, the usual. Boyfriend thinks I'm a cash machine. One nightclub catering to the rich, mindless crowd. In the city where the rich, mindless crowd is suddenly poor and mindless. Another club catering to the gay and decadent crowd, where the gay and decadent crowd suddenly think decadence means buying outrageous new throw cushions instead of getting loaded in a bar. And every half-wit, part-time hood in this city thinking, I know. Let's put the squeeze on the club owners. They must really, really want to substitute my inadequacies with their money because, after all, they want to stay up all night talking bullshit to morons because they enjoy it. it sounds pretty usual. Oh, thanks for the support. Hey, that's what I'm here for, boss. <laughs> yes, you know, if the bodyguard business partner thing doesn't work out, you should consider a career as a fucking life coach. A what? Never mind. Did you speak to Troy? Yeah, he said he loves you, but he can't handle work in the door at a gay club anymore. He says people are laughing at him. Who's laughing at him? I don't know. I think the little people who live in his head. The ones stuck in 1955. <laughs> oh, I love those people. And what's up with Desi? Yeah, he says he saw you last night. Yeah, and you was holding court with that Chloe Parker until uh, 4 a.m.? I was? Apparently so. Oh, my God. 45 years old, and I get my kicks doing blow with 17-year-old kids whose only claim to fame is that people know better what their vagina looks like than their face. I should be sent to prison. Shouldn't I? Yeah, most definitely. What's this money? Did you rob your own club? 
Tony, I just went to the bank for you, man. I don't want it in the bank. Hey, Tony, the door was open. Man, it's easier to get into your apartment than into your nightclub. Yeah, we have an Oguido policy at the club. Here I ain't so sure. Oh, I love getting racially abused by a spick. Yeah, who's a fucking taco, Tony? Uh, my business partner, Luis. Gentlemen, watch your language. We're in the great melting pot. We're not spicks or guidos or fags. We're proud Americans. Luis, this is Vince and Rocco, relatives of Gracie. And credit is to you. And guess what? We ain't here about Gracie. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> That's a start. I guess we don't have to beat you two lovers up. Yeah, good one. See you later. Oh, nice to meet you, muscles. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Fuck, there goes payroll. Who the fuck were those two assholes, T? <laughs> Fine men of the cloth. Who the fuck do you think they are? Ancelotti goons I borrowed money from way back. Uh, never mind. Amateurs. Come on, let's get out of here. Let's go. We need to go to Hercules. Give it up, Tom. Where'd the cash come from? Well, tell me you've been running a skim job. 100% legitimate, Luis. You know me. Total transparency. Sometimes I wonder if you brought me on as a partner just to share the blame when the IRS comes knocking. I was investing in your industry and acumen. Don't look for anything sinister here. That's what you say, T. But I'm kind of suspicious. Maybe when it's in that robbery made me paranoid. And maybe it's just hanging out with you. Who the fuck knows? Here we are. Troy, get over here. A very important client is coming tonight. We need complete discretion. Hey, <laughs> you know me, Tone. Don't ask, don't tell. Military Greg. Hey, this is serious. He's paranoid no one will buy his next CD if they know he'd rather be singing cabaret than rapping. As if people buy CDs anymore. Sure. Look, I really need to talk blah, to you, Tony. Blah, blah, blah. Another time, Troy. We'll be at Masonette. Yes, dear. Troy's getting anxious. We should all be getting anxious. The nightclub business is going to shit. Forget the banks. We're the ones who needed a bailout. No more of that shit left, eh? Time to be charming, Lulu. All right, Tom. Hey, Al. I gotta make some calls. You work the floor. Coming in, not in them clothes. 
Not with that attitude. Enjoy looking for a job in this economic climate, motherfucker. Yeah. Yo, what the fuck, eh? Tell this clipboard and earpiece motherfucker to back up, Al. Back up? Yo, what's the problem, D? You asking me? Yo, relax. Go inside. I got it. Yeah, go relax. Go inside, eh? Yo, no, mommy. You need to okay. go relax. Later for you. Guys, ah. nice, shut up. OK? Jeez. Wow. Downtown's really changed you, man. You too good to take money from me and Enrique now? You know it ain't even like that, bro. Okay, you don't pay for shit in here. Okay, you just can't be looking like you came from selling dope on the corner. You say that like it's a bad thing. Tony, what do you think? <laughs> Jesse wouldn't let me dress like that. Huh? You see what I mean? Come to think of it, Lou, what the fuck are you wearing, huh? What? Go home and take a bath. <laughs> do nothing else. Put on some clothes, huh? Yeah, I had a complicated day, okay? All right, so take some time off. The girls in there could use a night off too. We up. Bye bye, gentlemen. Nice boss you got there. Stuck a fucking fag. Mike, come on. Yeah. That club of yours was bullshit. You gonna take us back to the heist or what? <laughs> Fuck, man. I thought I had road rage. Oh, yeah. I've been thinking about this. How many days a week do you work those corners? Seven days. Junkies need junk, rain, sleep, or shine. You ain't no postman, loco. You a pussy. All those hours, you make more slinging meat at burger shop than risking a bit on them corners. You sound like 5-0. Shit. You think Enrique could get a job at burger shop? What's your QH? 76, motherfucker. What they gonna let you do at burger shop with an IQ sub 80? They just about to let me wash the goddamn dishes. You see what I mean, now? They don't even have dishes at Burger Shop. All this shit is polystyrene. There ain't another job in the city for this dumb bastard to do. Hourly wage considered and all. You don't get no pussy work in Burger Shop, neither. If them Ivy League motherfuckers can't find work, what you think Rike's meant to do? Work them corners, man. Work them corners. I do don't mean nothing, man. You guys are better than this. I don't want any of us to go away again. Then come on board with us. We can start selling our own product. Your connections, man. We'll have the whole city on our gear. I took a bit for you once, man. I ain't going back there. You think I put in all this work to... Here we be. Thanks, Luis. Ladies, Al, tell that boss of yours we'll be back same time next week. Yeah, yeah see you on my huevos. I got left.